Hey, my name is Bill Clemens. My job here at the Century Ranch is to protect my corn. As you can see up there in that building, it says Blue Corn. My family is a proud sponsors and creators of Blue Corn. What we do is that we get the corn and put in blue syrup all over it. It gives it the color and it makes people's teeth blue. And who doesn't want their teeth blue? I'll tell you who. Commies. Commies don't want to be blue. That's why over there we got the red corn. The commies. I hate us. They hate us. And we hate them. And that's how we like it. We like it tough. We like it rough. So basically my job here is to breed and build these beautiful machines to the biggest. As you can see, these creatures need a little love, a little abuse by the hammer, and they just get bigger and stronger, just like me. You see, my pappy treated me just like I treat my sentries. I tell him what I want, and then BAM! And then BAM! And then BAM! They get bigger and stronger, and they become better people. And they are well prepared for the world that is out there. As you can see, there's my brother there, Johan Clements. He's a bit stupid. In fact, whenever we're doing the Cotton Eye Joe on Thursdays, he usually messes up. Even though it was a family tradition to learn it. That's a lie! No, I'll tell you what is a lie. The cake is a lie. He hasn't That's gotten true. over it ever since I told him. Ever since he played Portal for the last few weeks, He's been trying to figure out them hard puzzles. I finished it in a day. Took him weeks for him to finish. As soon as he found out the cake was a lie, he just freaked out. Ain't that right, Joe Hams? I'm still saying it's cheap. Alright, oh, okay, okay. Enough, enough brother left. As you can see on the floor, that blood represents all love. I love you. Tonight I'm gonna bang a bang up. Anyways, let's go ahead and move on. Supposedly what we like to do here at the Century Farm is that we like to name off the love of the centuries. This here is Claire. Her specialty is to give a lot, but not too much. This here is Big Earl. He's not necessarily big, but we use that as an ironic name because he's small. But he's big, if you know what I mean. This here is a teleport, he's not important. This here is Earl. He's Big Earl's brother. And I really don't get why we have him. He's kind of boring and stupid. All he does is that he just sits around and looks around all day, kind of like that. Claire is more important though. This here is my brother Georgie. Georgie Clemens. You see, what he likes to do is that he likes to pretend he's a spy, but he's really not. Ever since he was a little kid, he always drew little drawings of people getting backstabbed and crits for every single hit day he lands in the back. It just ain't happening. Is it happening for you? No. Apparently it doesn't. It just makes you a faggot. Anyway, let's go ahead and move on. Wait, where oh. did Georgie go? Never mind. What you talking about? What you Let's talking about? Let's just go. About? Come on. Come on, Bill. Alright. As you can tell by our lifestyle here at the Century Farm, we require a lot of work, love, and what I love most, abuse. If we all did what my mama told us, like, this was her favorite saying, it ain't gonna learn unless you hit it. Ain't that right, bro? Yep. I also thought Texans were dumb. They sure are. They sure are. Now why don't we go home and have some hot chocolate? You want some hot chocolate, cameraman? Woohoo! Wait, what's <laughs> No! Not my little poopy! <laughs> Come here, boss. I'm gonna teach you a lesson, you dirty comic. You're, this is your fault for reducing the economy in the world.
Well, come here, boy. I'm gonna teach you a lesson. Look, my peepee's -pee still in peace. I'm gonna raise you, and you're gonna be. <laughs> 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 <laughs>